What's up everybody? So today we're going to focus on something that we really don't show a lot of on the channel, but we really should because just about everybody that watches this uses these. We're taking a look at the Gorilla MPX Aluminum Multi-Purpose Ladder. Let's get it going. Gorilla has nothing to do with this channel, but I will tell you, this is probably my favorite ladder. I don't think I've ever owned one that was this easy to use and this light for the size. 18 feet for this, 375 pounds. You can put a person on each side of this ladder. A lot of positions, we'll talk about that. You're probably wondering about that thumbnail though, that giant chicken. Where does that come in? Well, you'll see a little bit later in the video. I'm gonna show you how high I can climb, but check out those rungs. Really nice traction support on that ladder. All together on this, you got 20 telescoping adjustable positions and a lifetime warranty. I'm telling you, this thing is really cool. I can't wait to show you this. Check it out. We're going to flip those right there. We're going to push that in. That's basically all you have to do to adjust these. Now, what you got, these levers here on the right and the left-hand side, all you got to do is turn them. The top one there, you push that in, and that allows you to adjust it into an extension ladder or your step ladder position. Automatically clicks. You don't have to worry about finding that position and locking it in. Then right here, you got those levers. Just turn them. They actually turn very smoothly, and then you can extend that out very, very easily. Check that out. Then you can go down here, turn them again, and that's really about it. It'll lock itself. Now, I got a 22-foot steel Warner ladder basically the same thing, but nowhere near as easy to adjust as this ladder right here If you have different height elevations or maybe you're working on stairs check it out You can adjust that to work at basically any height you need and what's really nice about it. It's not Brand new. It's not new technology, but it's just extremely easy to do you can use it as the extension ladder, the double-sided twin step ladder, the 90-degree wall ladder, and a stairway step ladder. Now, the ladder weighs 34 pounds, and if you didn't want to carry that around, check that out. You can actually take the bases off and make this a little bit smaller if you don't need that height. So then you basically cut that weight in half, which is a really nice feature, and you also have those heavy-duty feet at the bottom of each side. And just to show you again, all you have to do just turn those knobs, that's gonna unlock it. You don't have to worry about pulling pins out. You slide it to where you want it to be, you adjust it again, and it locks in automatically. It does not get any easier than that. And even though this is a larger ladder, the storage width on this, only 26 inches. And in case I forget, it is a Type 1AA, 375 pound ladder. All right, let's talk some numbers here. The assembled depth, you're looking at 8.5 inches. Assembled height, you're looking at 54.7 inches. The assembled width, you're looking at 23.62 inches. The base spread, 23.65 inches. The ladder extension maximum height, you're looking at 15 feet. The extension ladder minimum height, you're looking at 9 feet. In industry, standard ladder height feet, 17 inches. The reed height, 18 feet. Rung depth. You're looking at one inch. Step ladder maximum height, close, seven feet. Step ladder maximum height, open, four foot. Step rise, 12 inches. Storage depth, <laughs> 8.5 inches. Storage height, 4.56. Long story short, if you wanted to go high up in the air, this ladder will do it. Now, me personally, I'm scared of heights, but for the, the subscribers of this channel, I wanted to prove to not only them, but myself, I could go high. How high? Well. I just got done watching one of my children's movies, and I said to myself, I don't think that this is real. But I wanted to see for myself if Disney was lying, this is what happened. Oh man, I knew that story wasn't full of <laughs> Woo! Oh, really high up there. I'm gonna kick that giant's <laughs> and find me that golden goose. And once I do, those golden eggs are mine. Buy myself something real nice. I thought you were supposed to be a goose, but all you are is a stupid giant chicken. Now put that golden egg in my hand. Let's go. Get in there. Ah! <laughs> now all I gotta do is take these golden eggs without that stupid <laughs> giant seeing me. I climb down the griddle ladder. Oh, there he is. These eggs are mine. You want them? Come get them. Run, 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 run. Now, 
Now it's time to head back down that gorilla ladder. Stream the sturdy. Make sure you check it out in the description below. Now I know that I'm wearing different clothing right now and that the giant is supposed to fall, but we just didn't have the budget for that effect. But it was amazing how my clothes just seemed to change by themselves. Very cool stuff. Now what about changing this into an extension ladder from the step ladder position? One of my biggest issues with the steel ladders where they were really heavy, you needed at least two people to do it. Not with this, this thing is extremely light. Only 34 pounds, check it out, you just lay it down, you, you flip your hatches, your latches, whatever you wanna call them, stretch it out, and then you go into the other side, do the exact same thing, and you just lift it up. Just about anybody can do this. That is what's really impressive. And I will tell you again, I have never talked to anybody from Gorilla. This is the first time using a Gorilla ladder. And uh, I am really, really happy with this thing, man. I don't think I can even look at my Warner ladder again. It's probably going up for sale. But check it out. You just open it up, it clicks, and you just lift it. Don't believe me? Well, I'm going to show you right now. And again, super simple. That aluminum makes such a difference. Have you ever used one of these ladders? I'm just curious if you've ever used the Gorilla ladder. What ladder do you use? And is this something that you might be willing to switch over to? Because I'm switching. You got some really nice heavy duty feet down there at the bottom. Check it out. That's fully extended. You're at the 18 feet. And it is extremely sturdy up there. You know, it always makes me nervous when you've got those brackets in the middle, but yeah, no issue at all with shaking or twisting or bending. But those feet really grab hold nice wherever you're trying to put them, whether it's on concrete, you know, dirt, no issues there. But yeah, extremely solid. And if I wanted to lower this, again, just flip, bring it down. I don't have to worry about smashing my fingers or pinching my fingers in with the Warner ladder that I had, I really had issues with that. And that was one of the worst tools I've ever had in my garage, actually. That was a video that I did. And this one here completely changes the game. If I wanted to, come over here, flip that again, bring it down. And then just bring it right back down into the step ladder position. Close it up. That is it. And you don't need the two people to help you do it. You can do it yourself. Really, anybody can. If you can lift 34 pounds, then no issue. And if you want to close it up... Just push in that button that will actually lock in for you and you don't have to worry about this thing opening up accidentally i really like how all you got to do is push that button up on top you just smack it on the right smack it on the left and then open it up again super easy super fast really restored my faith in the ladder manufacturers now here we go all i used to use warner they might have something out there that is better than this i don't know i haven't tried it this is the first time I've ever used a Gorilla Ladder. I absolutely love it. The weight is down on this thing. It is extremely solid. It feels really great when you're up there. And I'm scared to death of heights. As far as it goes with ease of use, man, this thing is so simple. You just smack that on the right, smack that on the left, open it up, close it up, bring it into an extension position. doesn't matter. It is just all in all a great freaking ladder. You don't have to worry about pinching your hands. You know, those dowels on the side right here, you know, you just flip them and when you extend it out or bring it down, you just flip it again and it locks in automatically. It is just a super, super nice ladder. And this is something we take for granted, you know. We use these things out around the house or on the, the site. And are they heavy? You know, are they hard to store? Are they hard to transport? And this is no. And they have larger ladders and smaller ladders, whatever you need. So if you like this video, don't forget to smash that like button smush that bell notification so you don't miss anything come say hi to us on the instagram page at tool review zone and don't forget to come see us on toolreviewzone.com for all the new tool releases